to Sea Story Cup 4. I'm joined on the couch uh, with Wreckful and Noxious. I was I was searching pretty deep. Oh my there. god, that what was really the hell? Like, I was like, what's this guy's, guy's name? Yeah, that's messed yeah, up. Yeah, with Nox Noxious. Noxious uh, actually has a really cool. Wait, real wait, name. wait. Feels bad, man, in chat for Noxious right now. Yeah, it feels what, bad, man. Everybody what, just spam it. What's your What's your real name, Noxious? Kasem. Kasem. Let's yeah. pretend he was searching Dude, that's for that's pretty real epic, name. man. Yeah, you have you have you have a uh, Byron. I like that. Well, what's the origins of Byron? It sounds like a like a British. Uh, my mom's. Uh, my mom's. A it was a, like uh, like oh. a, a you were peasant. just making fun of my mom. Like a croquet player. It's like mm, I'm gonna go play some croquet with Byron. He's yeah. making fun of my mom because I was saying that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is awesome, man. I, okay, so the reason I'm wearing these pajamas. We can tell us later, but yeah, the game's I, about to start. I, yeah. I think the, the, the game reason, doesn't matter. Right, so, it's a druid versus druid. It'll explain itself. Oh, wild growth. Okay, now wild you can explain. It's druid. It's druid mirror type. I uh, just want to put it out there that Rekful's wearing his mom's PJs, and we'll let that image sink in. Okay, the airline lost yeah. my luggage. Did, well, did, did, did they put your mom's PJs on you while you're at it? I decided. They're like, sir, the sir, sir, way, we lost your luggage. By the way, here's your mom's pajamas. The best put way them to go on. Like, 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 hey, sir. <laughs> sir, <laughs> we're saving lives here at the oh airport. Oh, my God. Please do not. <laughs> Cross, cross through the scanner in your mother's pajamas. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Oh. God damn it. He didn't even let me sneak a word in to explain myself. Okay, well, no, TSA never lets you finish your sentences. Yep. Feels bad. <laughs> I'm crying. Okay, so whoever's playing right now, that Eloise has got like a god hand. Uh, yeah, Eloise is the one with the Darnassus and Wild Growth, I believe. Vortex is the one. Oh man, that's gonna Okay, hurt. so one person's happy and one person's sad. Well, I mean, technically this uh, Keeper of the Grove can do quite a lot of work. Because, I mean, in effect, it's not really going to lose yeah. much. But you have to use an Innervate on that just yeah, to deal with man. the Darnassus. So. But Feels then you, have, you don't even have to play the following turn. Well, I mean, you have to hero power down the Aspire afterwards. So. Uh, yeah, yeah, I guess. Yeah. So. I mean, the clunky part for Eloise is, you know, if the Aspire gets uh, hit by the Keeper, then do you play Shade or do you do Wild Growth? If you Wild Growth, then you delay Shade. Wow! Oh my god. Whoa, that's even clunky. I'm full, I'm full of regret. Like, just okay. on behalf of Vortex, that sucks. I, I actually think the game's <laughs> over. Wait, think, I'm, I'm gonna... Well, okay, well, I've let's... seen that before wow. from, uh, like, uh, who was it? Uh, Tice. Once he had a hand like this, where he just had all the ramp, and his opponent had none, and he still ended up losing. Oh, there no you go. way. That's really good. That's hype. That's hype. We yeah. got the Drew of the Claw. You can charge down the 2-3. charge it, kill the 2-3. Yep. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Then if they don't have Keeper of the Grove, you're probably golden because they don't want to trade a shade. They have to have yeah. Wrath, and they only had like they're, they're only gonna have three mana. So. Oh my God, he almost, <laughs> <laughs> no, right? almost missed the hero. Whoa, no, he, what? Oh, oh interesting. Now they get to play Shredder. Now I guess the Shredder, which I is. I feel like you always charge it. Yeah, generally speaking, you want to charge just because. Um, <laughs> okay, sure. He can't hero power it down. Right. There's no way no, for him to just kill a shade the plates. They probably don't have anything. He, to he also three. wouldn't have mana to keep her down either. So. Right. He'd have three, so he's stuck with wrath or nothing. He happened to draw wrath. Yeah. So it, she, okay. she wreckful. Well, even then, right? Oh. Uh, yeah. Like I they, they, they draw wrath, but that takes up their entire turn. They Listen, can't I did that like or... 500 times. You know what? I just series. corrected the other commentators and they did it twice. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> the irony. Uh, I think it was. All right. Well, <laughs> well that's an awkward. Oh, what a great card. Yeah. Okay. Watchmen. Are you mocking me? Well, like, because she's going... She's going to Wrath Hero Power that. Yeah, and then and that then actually, actually gets, gets to attack. attack. That's pretty funny. Oh, oh man. Interesting. Nah, you don't really need that. No. You, oh. can, you can save it for next turn. All right, here we go. Wrath Wait, Hero Power. We're way ahead. Yeah. Let's do it. The, the thing is, too, that uh, Vortex doesn't have, like, five mana to spend either next turn is to keep or something. God, Fred, and you have a beautiful voice, man. Do I? Thank yeah. you, thank you. My mom gave my me ears. that. My mo your mom gave your PJs. My mom gave me my voice. Hey, these PJs have served me well for the last 30 hours. <laughs> yeah. I have no color clothes. I'm, I'm sorry, dude. Losing your luggage is literally one of the worst things that could ever yeah. happen to you while traveling. Okay, so this, this might be like a little dance game, but <laughs> oh, no. I, 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 was up for, I was up for 24 hours. That's never Listen, how you let practice me say one anything. Thing. Let me say one thing. I was up for 24 hours. I was on a plane. I've been playing for like 17 hours. Yeah. And then I, I got here and I showered. And then I had to put the same underwear back so on. My question, <laughs> uh, uh, my question did, you least, did you at least turn it inside out? Right. So that way, so that way oh, I didn't two, think about that. Two oh sides never God. touch. Two sides never touch again. That's yeah, but then the little button in the front, like, kind of. <laughs> <made, it laughs> oh, you. geez. Wait, we yeah. lost the game feed. Oh, man. No, the game feed's coming back. Give it a break. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, he picked up BGH. Stop bullying the game. At least it's something to play. I think that you might be doing that. Uh, tempo BGH looks good, but if he was afraid of Keeper of the Grove earlier, he's still afraid of it. Uh, um, 
So my guess is he still wouldn't play. Yeah, I guess it's it, sh it doesn't die to the two attack minion. But the shade is still getting out of control here. And then he's gonna you can Ancient of Lore here, which is so powerful. And then uh, you just have big tempo on the board. And he also and she also drew Keeper. So Keeper the Grove of Silent Sylvanas. Oh, it's that, that is wrecked. Yeah. It's a, yeah. But let's let's it's not over till it's over. Let, let's know, focus wow, on this. Wow, Rekpo, you've grown so much as a commentator, I'm man. Just, I'm so proud. Listen, guys. <laughs> listen, guys. There could be a misclick on the other side where they don't. Yeah, we've seen some pretty crazy yeah, some stuff like so that far. happens. And down goes Vortex. There's APM in Hearthstone. It's important. Right. Uh, th there is for um, like for, the, for crushing the melons thing, man. If you're trying to get to the boots as fast as you can. Actually, yeah, like a face hunter mirror match, getting to the boots is no easy feat. Yeah, yeah. it's pretty oh. intense. Dude. So do you just go for come. Force of Nature or? You just Sylvanas and Sylvanas is your best you chance. You force the nature; that. they still have a minion they still have on the board, minion, and, right. just, you're so, you're, and they're dropping another minion yeah, yeah. next turn for sure. There's no way. Six cards. You. <laughs> this is brutal. And then let's see, what can you do with the rest of the two mana? You can wild growth. Yeah, I guess you get closer to the inevitable force of nature savage war. What do you trade? Do you trade the shade? Do you even trade? Oh, yeah, that's a good question. Maybe you don't trade. I mean, you don't have combo, so maybe like you have a good incentive to trade. Um, I trade the shade at this point because it's gonna be vulnerable to BGH next turn. The five five stays uh, stays good, really and this one can die to the wrath. So if you he... don't trade, how much damage are you doing? Thirty to fourteen, You're getting them onto thirteen. Yeah, exactly. So it's really just about if you had combo, I'd do it. But you have to go to the club with swipe, so that's already you know eight damage there. Um, yeah, the, I mean, there's an argument for just even hero powering, just doing damage. Damage with the <laughs> two two. Yeah. But uh, I mean, she she's so far ahead. I don't think she has to worry too much about it. And uh, Vortex is stuck playing Ancient of Lore. Oh yeah, I was talking about the hero power. Yeah. So uh, what what can she draw here? Uh, what can Vortex draw? She might have to draw. He might innervate? have to draw Innervate, innervate and, then and then combo. combo. Yeah, yeah, that's that's probably the best he'd do. But he's <laughs> 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 he literally draw two, two other cards. Gross. Wow, it's like he played Coat Magus. Wait, that <laughs> entire hand. <laughs> wait, wait. If he, he can play that entire hand is so. Oh, I was gonna you say could play bad everything, word. and it would do, it would do nothing. Well, no. If you could if you could force nature savage or savage, you would win. <laughs> right. <laughs> Pretty much. You do twenty two. So, so if if Millhouse came out the next turn, he'd win. So, so if, if you can only do twenty two, so maybe not. You, okay. Well, Mil the Ancient of Lore would. Millhouse comes out, and you draw Drew to the Claw. You charge it, then force nature savage or savage. Dude, that's sick. So bam. That's really sick. But the other person has to actually have Millhouse in their deck. Right. Right. And um, and we all know how that goes. I mean, you, the, you've done it, right? Yeah, I've done it. No. <laughs> Noxious is playing, um, by the way, in the tournament, tomorrow, right? Yeah. Tomorrow. You better have Millhouse, you better have Millhouse dude, or, or I will ban you from the, you can't the, see the my casting deck couch. List. Don't even try. I've got some really cool decks, though, at the very least. Okay, good. Uh, good. You will take the place uh, as me, because I'm playing some boring decks this tournament. Oh, Lotheb. Lotheb Man. hype. Stop it, the combo uh, next turn. Right. You don't, uh, you don't die. You know that at least force yeah, you, nature savage or maybe just one savage or yeah, I mean do you kill the two two? I mean I don't even know what you do. No, dude, you, you like, definitely loathe them, but no, the the problem is afterwards you actually don't do anything. You, you just press die. escape. Concede. Mm. Actually no alt F4 works as well. See, this is the point where I'm at the gym and I'm playing Druid and I get super hyped and like I get really mad that I lose. And I I deadlift like literally whatever amount I put on the bar. Okay. Except uh except I don't. You don't deadlift. I fail miserably and I get laughed at by the little girl next to me. Uh, as she's lifting, I love you know, little girls next to me. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That went. That went. And that—that that is why they came to Beckful and said, "Beckful, you are the best caster. And we need you at back. this. We need you to cast two series in a row." Yep. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but no, my feelings. My feelings were hurt though when they they made fun of me in the bottom right corner. Why? Wait. What? What happened? They they, they put a little face and it was like this. And I looked like broke back to the emote on Twitch. Uh, oh, I was like, well, yeah. I only know one broke back, but. And then. Um, that's it? Yeah. What was it? Oh, was and it then, that and then, so they put a little icon over your face and. Yeah. And, and it said it. rank 18 caster. Oh. Uh, are like, you rank 18? At casting. Oh, that's okay, what they gotcha. mean, right? but, Yeah, but no, I was. It's like never lose, dude. Yeah, I wasn't sure yeah, if that was a reference that. to like maybe you were rank 18 or something. Yeah, maybe I was one time. <laughs> a long time yeah. ago. A long time ago. How, how, how much Hearthstone have you actually been able to play? Because uh, you went this to BlizzCon. Month, this month I haven't played Hearthstone. I played maybe like 10 games. Well, everyone's been traveling. Like, it's really yeah, hard I, don't think, I don't think anyone's really played this month. But uh, last month we played. Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. Uh, all right, so we got Druid 
And Druid has the one, two, three. Uh, no, the Druid has the yeah. one, two, three. Oh, sorry, the Paladin's not the yeah. one, two, three. When did oh, they not? Rank 18 caster, man. That's right. That's right, bro. I'm That's right. why we stick together. Yeah. Here's the thing. They said, you know what? That, that previous match was full of too much analysis. Let's have no analysis next okay, match. Okay, Nox, okay. just get in there. Frodan, get in there. What's up, Rackful? Sorry. I'm yelling over I you. I feel like... You're not loved? I feel like the rank someone is at casting really depends on the audience, you know? Because That's if you absolutely of, if you have, true. If you have a lot of moms in the chat... Who you're give the their best. sons PJs. Who are angry. Right. Oh, yeah. Okay. Because their mom gave them PJs. No, the other thing that I where to that say. Sense. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I give up. Let's just talk about the game. No, no, I get you, dude. I get you. It's, well, yeah, uh, we get it. We just... Rank rank is in the eye of the beholder, right? Yeah. Okay. Except, yeah. yeah. Except in Hearthstone, where it's just written on there. It's like when you, when you're teaching a you know freshman, you look really smart, and then you actually talk to people who know what they're talking about, and so yeah. you're dumb. It's it's interesting that um, mm. Eloise chose not to do anything with the coin here. I guess because. I'm the actually that's when it gets challenged, but like it can't die I, next turn. I was gonna say the like the, it only dies to like Argent Lens. Yeah, like, and, like Seal of Light. Like, yeah, exactly. Really weird paladin, like Light's Justice. <laughs> something, this is something absurd, right? That just shouldn't yeah. be there. So, uh, but I think the idea is that the coin is gonna be play. used with the yeah. Keeper of the Grove um, yeah, on, she, on she turn three. Makes sense. So how are we feeling right here? We're wrathing. Yeah, the Knife Juggler would be too. Would be I, really threatening. Yeah. If we don't wrath, we actually drop their asses. Cog hammer, we lose. Yeah, well, we the just thing, lose. Like, if you wrath, the because here there's a good chance that she goes for the wrath on the keep um, the zombie child because she can coin out keep her next turn. But because of the cog hammer, that play will backfire. Well, if if you cog hammer, then you keep her the three two. And you yeah you you silence it in that case, yeah. but you can't kill it. And the idea is probably to kill zombie chow here and then, then play wrath, keeper, yeah. but or keeper. it's not gonna work out. Um, not exactly. Ooh. Oh. oh, now. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, it's greedy, though, because coin swipe also screws you. Yeah. Tough oh, play. I didn't say the bad word. You did it. What? You would say swipe. I said screws. screws. Uh, That's okay. Yeah. I mean, they're buffing the screw. What would you in the say? GVG board. Wait, wait, okay. You're commentating. You're the best commentator in the world. Uh, I would say um, destroy. Oh, or Rex. Or Rex. I, I would say. Uh, Rex, you. Okay, I can use. Some of my names. I, I would say uh, annihilate, befuddle, befuddle. bamboozle. I would say yeah, bamboozle. You would never say befuddle. Are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're, you're right. It's probably too confusing for new players. Oh god, don't give him the next loss. Oh, this Twitch yeah. admin loves this. All right, it's great. Well, now the keeper comes down and silences the uh, juggler, and now it's like, well, do I play Aldor or do I? Muster for battle. This is a little awkward. Yeah, I mean, if you're worried about swipe like you were last turn, I don't think muster uh, yeah. is necessarily the play you're going to go this with. This is an awkward turn. Let's all be honest. Yeah. Uh, yeah, well, you want to talk about it? For justice. Nope. No, because then it becomes more awkward when you talk okay. about it. Well, this is uh, kind of a good middle ground. Middle, you, middle lo you lose uh, one charge on the... Yeah. The cog hammer. I mean, it's not necessarily a big deal. You don't need it. Even. Do you really need to... Oh, uh, we have two swipes, so... Oh, two swipes. There it is. I was asking if you really need to swipe, because yeah. maybe you could slow play it. Okay, now Lotheb comes what down. What a quartermaster, though, And then right? we get the counter Lotheb. Yeah. And, and then we get the Alder. On the, yeah, that's actually oh. going to be a crazy tempo swing. Bam, bam. Yeah, the Aldor is really big. And Druid's supposed to do this to the... Or Pal is supposed to do this to the Druid. You're supposed to use the tempo cards to take really big advantage of it. Wow, what a crazy... Boom. Thing. That was so bam, big. Bam, bam, bam. Although now swipe have, also finds a target. And, yeah, but uh, that's your second swipe. I guess you might have to do it. Oh, it's going to be followed by Dr. Boom, which makes his use of that swipe yeah. early even clunkier, unless a BGH is picked oh. up. Oh! Yeah. Well, okay. swipe is still too good to pass, right? Yeah. Leave the Aspirant and then let it trade okay, with the now, outdoor. The, okay, the Druid needs... Oh my god. It needs, needs a big game on it, right? Yeah, it needs BGH. But well, we can't I, we can't lure into it because we're one mana short innervating it. Yeah, if the Aspire had lived, maybe, but not in this case, so. Yeah. Unless I can Oh! oh! Well uh, it's still not even that exciting because you can't play anything else at the same time. Well, it's still fine. You can kill a boom bot, take four to the face, I and mean, then kill Dr. Boom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but still you can still kind of like, slow. You're play sitting it, there though. as a yeah, you, you you have a good slow play hand. You have the three sevens. Yeah. yeah, triple seven, which is really lucky. That's that's actually that's something we lucky. ignored. Yeah, three sevens. Okay, it's almost like when you get four sevens in Final uh, Fantasy seven. They don't matter. Yeah. Oh well, I it, it's I pretty was cool. Really, I was making a casino rep, like you get three. I get it. Slot. I get it. Yeah. I get it. 
Final Fantasy VII. Because you're a gambling addict. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I just I want to talk about Final Fantasy VII because everyone made fun of me for talking about it last time we commented it together. Oh, was it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, was, dude, that's <laughs> that's next level referencing. Yeah. You're gr you're growing up as a cast director. Oh, yeah, the meta, bro. the meta. I'm yeah. trying so hard right now. Yeah. Too good for me. I don't think before I talk though. Frodo told me I should think before I talk. I don't talk. I think it'd be a good look for you. I really do. How are you thinking before you talk and talking and replying? No, to I told you I'm thinking a lot less right now. Okay, but if you're commentating BlizzCon, you think. Uh, Is, isn't it better for for everybody that way? Okay. Yeah, thinking's good. You yeah, should right. try it once in a while. Hey. <laughs> you just threw uh, that out there, I man. I love you, Rackful. I uh, love thanks, you. And, I love you in your pajamas. Yeah. Yeah. By the way, Rekvo has not removed his legs from Noxious's lap. Yeah. It is still happening. Feels good, man. He's got a better cure than God. <laughs> Feels good. <laughs> Feels good, That's man. good. That's not good. And I should run away, but fuck it. I'm too comfy. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, now Drew can maybe start turning it back. What would you start with, though? Would you start with the Ancient of War, or would you start with the Ancient of Lore? War looks good since we've seen an Aldor. Equality being played here would actually weaken the enemies to where right. you can use your Keeper of the Grove to finish one of them off. So... I don't know. It's kind of it's kind of awkward either way. Yeah. Wow, there was a the second Aldor though is pretty. Yeah, painful. with the Shredder as well. Um, it, it actually it could still go it could still go either way. Yeah, yeah. We like that. We like that. So here's a really cute play. You could silence your own Ancient yeah. of War, but the problem with that is then you have no answer to Tyrion, so you, you probably have you to don't hold do on that. to it. Yeah. yeah, you've already played the first uh, Keeper, so. Wrath. Ah, uh, that that's. Ooh. I mean. This is pretty good stuff. Wrath on the 3-3. Three, three. Yeah, I kind of like... Uh, I mean... Yeah, there's really no reason not to use the Wrath here. The 1-5, you'd like to, to use at some point. But you could weaken, uh, like, a Shredder, let's say, if it gets used, where you can actually kill it with... Is there any the argument to Wrath uh, the Belcher? The Belcher, yeah. Kill it? Was, Probably not. It's just, you'd have to have more swipes in your deck, which you just don't. This this Dr. Boom's going to be a comeback card. Uh-oh. Oh. 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 That card is maybe. I mean, card. that's really Paladin might just tempo Paladin, the game. No, not that. Yeah, it's not Paladin's gonna kill you next turn. Yeah, yeah the turn dead. after. Just push through. It's just like this Ancient of War not being a five attack meeting. It's just the difference between winning and losing. Belcher in for sure because it's getting overkilled by Lore and the, the two, two, else. You've seen two swipes. So yeah, so. there's nothing else to kill it unless. I wonder what he's thinking about. Uh, uh I mean, he could also clean kill it with three two. Instead right, of, with uh, three, three, and the two, two, and then use the. Yeah, you keep yeah. the Belcher like as healthy as possible. Why? Um, but it, it really, there's no reason to. No, you should use the Belcher. Yeah, In this it case, it doesn't matter too much, but you should use the Belcher. Wonder. You've all seen two rats, right? So there's like. Yeah. No, that's true. Seen two swipes. A lot of stuff. You've seen some. Sh Whoa! Oh, oh, a trade. Interesting. Now that I didn't expect. That Three, could actually six, turn the 12. game upside down because I thought it was setting up for lethal, but now with Dr. Boom. Um, uh, well, I think the guy maybe he has... He, it's one off lethal if the guy hero powers because he, he has 16 with Consecrate, right? And then uh, health right. 17. Right. You could always go for Dr. Boom Innervate Keeper to kill uh, the 3 2. Yeah, it's so probably going to be what. It, it's like the biggest temple plane. You set up a really yeah, good Savage nice Orb board. Nice kind of like it. It's like you're no longer in the mode where you can like I want to save this for Tyrion. You're just like I have to. All right. So what? So if Druid, two save, two silver, sir, champion. That's right. If Druid avoids dying here, and runs, uh, close enough, but not quite. Uh, this, nine, it, 11, 15, Yeah, you're yeah, right. One off. Dude, and then it's now like, are you afraid of Force Nature Savage Roar? <laughs> That's the question, right? Uh, if I go face, then you're dead to The it. classic struggle of against Druid. Well, you're just yeah. going to throw your Consecrates and clear everything with the... Well, actually, he's probably going to clear the Boom 2 the way he's been playing. Yeah. Yeah, it's like you trade a 3-3 three, three three, three, Yeah, exactly. 3-2 three, in there. Yeah. You attack with a 3 attack, and then you pretty much just... Wait, wait, wait He's not doing double Consecrate? Whoa. Okay. What is he doing? Oh, he's going to isolate the Boom, so he plays around combo. So, he's yeah, he's only leaving uh, the Doctor Boom alive. Unless this kills, like, the, the Sludge Belcher. Oh, he didn't Hero Power. Oh! oh! Force of Nature Savage Roar with Ashley. That's right. It's, this, it's, it's that time. Could this is it. It's that time, boys. After the big game hunter from earlier, do we pick up the Force? Bam. Nope. Oh, dude, that was crazy. Thought it was it. Wait, what could you find? Uh, Maybe Drew the Claw? Just the Force of Nature, actually, would be like more than enough out of this. No, it's 15 damage. With, uh, no, but you can, I mean, you can uh, remove a lot of the board. You don't kill anyone, but... Oh, crap. Not quite. 
Uh, she'll lower so for heals. You heal and then attack. You're at 10 and then you. Six, die. seven, eight. Nine. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, uh, like no, one, damage I think he's one damage over. Yeah. That was that was a crazy moment where Druid almost won despite being behind all of that game. Yeah, that was very defensive from Vortex, but it's there gonna it pay off. There's a juice over. And uh, he'll take the win. Yeah, so that, that was a really close game, but I mean, that was kind of like a game that I don't think uh, Eloise had any business with. <laughs> I wonder, the I, yeah, with that I wonder start. how many cards were left in deck, though. Um, from the Paladin? Or you mean from, uh, from, from, from Force Nature, yeah. I don't know. I can't imagine there were that many. Yeah, it was pretty long. Yeah. Like you had. Yeah, you used uh, two lords two... already, so you drew a lot of cards. Well, no, the second only one, one was the heal. Draw. Oh, no, sorry. Yeah, right, right. But she did. She did. Um, I'm, I'm resident sleep. She never cycled the wrath either. Yeah, but she did use one. I mean, it, it does help a lot, pretty significantly. Yeah. Either, either way, it's like with, when Paladin curves like that, like Chow, which seems to be exactly what this Paladin keeps doing. Yeah. Like one, two, three. All right, Here's Patron the versus the mid-range Pally from Vortex. Uh, earlier it looked a lot more like a Flood Paladin. This time around it looks a little bit more standard, right? We saw him earlier with the Justicar shenanigans. Yep. Um, I, I'm not sure how good this deck is consistently against Paladin, but I have to imagine it's pretty good. I, yeah, I have to imagine that too. Um, we we might get roadblocked a bit. We didn't even see quality. It's, it's a one of probably if... Yeah. So we did see one equality, right? No, we didn't. We did in the previous when, game. When he I played think. against Eloise previously. Yeah. Uh, he had like a boombot lethal by Wait, a different equality. different series that I wasn't watching. Yeah, uh, I think that so, you were yeah. sleeping through. Okay, okay. Sorry. Equality to get some boombot and I yeah, I wasn't commentating oh. that. Okay, come on. This is an awkward draw. So there's one equality to kill uh, patrons with. Oh, there it is. Oh, well, see, bot. Yeah. I can curve. Before that, if you just had the heal power for two turns, you're in big trouble. But I'm not sure. Maybe this is bad because now uh, Eloise can get um, the kill and battle rage yeah. value, and then you have to overkill the armor smith with the True Sword Champion, right? Just to get to be done with it. Oh wow! You know, Chow hero power, but then that opens up battle rage. Even yeah, like we were talking about. Well, and he gets a full clear too, so. Yeah, and still has the one one with initiative. Oh my god, oh. that's really good. That's insane. Two arcane intellects for two mana. Bam. Yes, please. Sorcerer's armor smith. Oh, that's, that might be even better. You know, you can save the other one and then cool task one, and then try to set up an even bigger uh, battle rage number two. I mean, it is tempting to go for second battle rage, so that way you can set up for like death spite, and you have um, the the patron in hand, but you know this is mid-range, therefore um, they have a chance of having a quality patron right. uh, consecration, so patron's not as good compared to like Secret Paladin, which probably doesn't run that. I want to just press the Battle Rage. It feels good. Yeah, it feels really good. You still do keep the Armorsmith, right, at one health. So. You do have better board tempo by developing Cruel Taskmaster, though. Like, and if you bait the Consec early, then your patrons are somewhat safe. And there's no way he's going to cons consecrate a board like this. So you can use Slam afterwards to trade up into something like a Belcher. Yeah. Let's see what happens. I mean... Battle Rage is too I tempting. Wouldn't, yeah, right? I, I wouldn't blame second Battle Rage. Here. I like it's it. It's really tempting. All right. I we need a, what do we need? We need a Death Spike. Oh. Yeah, actually. Missed the yeah, so yeah. Doesn't matter, just have shields. Or Alex Rock. Like all those things don't matter. Okay, juggler gives some potential for a comeback here. And if it misses, if it misses though, misses, yeah, pretty punishing. Bam. Alright, there it is. It's finally right. some good fortune here for Vortex. Never miss. Then do you slam that thing to to show who's boss? I guess you do. And then you and play the acolyte. acolyte. And we're still looking for Death Spite. Yeah, yeah. Doctor Boom's coming out soon, though. Uh, he's gonna have to, yeah. like, the executors are gonna have to fall. Yeah. And uh, the Belcher does make it so that Doctor Boom curves better, but you don't want to let that uh, acolyte draw more cards. Um, but the thing about Doctor Boom is that like a whirlwind execute is one of the cleanest ways you can deal with it yeah. mana wise, and then you even can chain it with things like the Grim Patron. Yeah. They were that still can either go for... really well or poorly. Yeah. But usually, well. Oh my. That's a. Uh, Second Acolyte. I mean, if you play it, you're guaranteed to get only one card out of it, unless you go for the Cruel Task immediately, which I assume uh, could be done. The thing is, if you ever need the, you go for the, the ping. Task. Yeah, if you ever, ever need the ping for. Uh, Although you know, we for have an no activator enabler. for Execute right now. Yeah, yeah exactly. But th there's a lot of them in the deck, so it's likely one's going to be found. Mm. You're getting one closer to it. Justice. All right, well. Uh, Coin Dr. Boom, most reasonable outcome. 
Okay. There's probably a big game hunter in that deck, right? So big game hunter and two whirlwinds yeah. would actually do it. We could just we could two two into it and execute. Right now, so. Yeah, executes are fine. Um, that's about. Well, I mean, execute works whirlwind, already. Whirlwind draw would be great though. Grim patron whirlwind it'd execute. Too, it'd be too good. Come on, I'm never lucky. Uh, Sylvanas. Sylvanas is actually not bad either. It's like, how do you deal with this outside of an owl? Play it, Belcher. It, it does play Belcher. <laughs> I was going to say, yeah. you play Belcher, and I feel like she's... But then again, if the Belcher's played, then that gives you a lot more, because you're the one taking initiative, right? Yeah. And if somehow you find an, uh, like an enabler for the... the oh, I really wanted to see that whirlwind. It would have been fun. See the blue bo moon bots fly around. <laughs> I guess the patrons, and then, yeah. like, the old, like, tension. Like, does he kill the patron or copy the patrons? It's hey. pretty... <laughs> What a big difference. <laughs> yeah. like, There's either two or zero. Never won. Yeah, well, you're really cool laughing, rise, right? right? That's exactly what uh, Ben Brode wanted. Oh, yep. So you're, you're doing what he wants. Yeah, right ben, Bro ben Brode's right. RNG is good for the game. But you know what he's not oh. right about? Poison Please. Blade is not a good card. <laughs> <laughs> Who's saying? No one says that. Ben Brode said. In Tavern Brawl, Poison Blade is pretty nuts. That one okay, where you give you a new hero power. If you have a different hero power. They, they expect you to like play like, slideshow Dude, spell you, eaters. No, 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 no. no, no the, the, the Tavern Brawl. I get it. Tavern Brawl. I get it. Come on. The did, new you, did, you, did you play that one? I get it. Did you play it, though? No. Okay, so what, every, every, every time you hit hero power, you get a new one that you can Listen. use immediately. Listen. Listen, Frodo. I got like a 20 damage There's like an poison epic blade. rogue weapon comes out. Oh! <laughs> nice, uh, nice That to was draw. fun. Wrecked. Thanks, Ben Brode. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally like the thanks Obama thing, but it's yeah. thanks Ben Brode. Thanks, bro. When, you're comment when I'm commentating, I love RNG. When I'm hilarious. playing, I What's the game it. without, like, like, you're playing, know, when we were right? watching the Control Warrior vs. Control Warrior, I was like, oh my god, this is so boring. <laughs> where's, where's, like, we my... literally made bets like whether or not it could hit 100. Yeah. Armor and, or 100 life, and we and it did. The dream yeah. is real. That's what, There needs to be more unstable portal in tournaments right now. We're set. Wow, that's a whiff. Yeah, that's not well, good. I mean, how do you use this one, though? Because right. now, like, um, that totem golem can become that plus weapon removal uh, on the Sludge Belcher. Do you play, you just play Sylvanas, right? And just, like, let your, let, let the Paladin try to deal with that board as well? Yeah. I wonder what he's thinking about. You could also patron. You could patron ghoul, yeah, but patron I wouldn't ghoul. do it. I don't. I don't dislike you have it. Two patrons, though. Yeah, I'd consider a patron ghoul just because of the. I still don't like it. Because I mean, you still have two death bites and two whirlwinds, and you're just gonna be able to get way better, you know, patron turns later, and the game's gonna go on for a long time. It's true. You're at 27 health. And it's, then, not... it's not a bad Sylvanas turn. So. Yeah. It's gonna. Yeah. Maybe, it's gonna go maybe, on for a maybe while. patron can bait out like the equality. The or first one. Or even yeah. silence. Maybe this patron doesn't have Death Spine and Whirlwind in the deck. I've oh, seen it. That'd be next level. That'd be the craziest patron deck ever. And plays double A-bomb and double ghoul. I have no double A-bomb. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Wild Pyro. Oh, oh that's the man. Now that's you're the thinking. Swag. Now that's you're thinking. Swag. Yeah. The Mad Bomber Grim Patron synergy. Oh. Yeah, the Mad Bomber Oh, that muster, that muster is pretty good against Sylvanas. <laughs> yeah. That was a good yeah. draw. But it, it won't matter because it'll still, it's still, still, it'll still, leave, still load up. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Oh. D I mean, Sylvanas is absorbing a lot of damage here. Oh, he doesn't. He sees that he didn't even get a single juggle on the totem golems. And now Sylvanas can trade into the 3-5. Yeah. This is no, that's not what you wanted at all. And the thing is, if there's a whirlwind that gets picked up, then that's a guaranteed steal on oh, like, you're something right. relevant. So he needs to do the trades now, right? I think so. Whoa! Or you know, maybe he's ambitious. Not. Yeah. He might be putting the the, the juggler in. He no, puts, but a, puts a juggler in, and then it takes a one on one. He melees it. Gotcha. That makes sense. But how do you deal with the five five? You don't. Okay. No, it's it's two out of. Uh, Oh, he didn't well, do it. Okay. It's getting okay. better and better. All right. It's fine. Whirlwind. 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 Let's do draw. it. I mean, he still has unstable cool. Uh, I want Whirl it. Oh. Uh, nope. Although so that... if we did draw Whirlwind, cost six. Okay, so let's see. Whirlwind wouldn't have been that exciting anyway. Yeah, I mean, the problem would be that you'd almost have to kill the... We really uh, like this death fight, though. Is, you want to set it up this turn, right? Yep. Yeah. But then... What do you do? You, you play, you play like, like Dread Corsair. Corsair, yeah. Corsair, yeah. Okay. Very passively. Like stable ghoul. Or and then you, you just unleash the patrons. Hold on to turn. the ghoul. Yeah, hold on to the ghoul. Next turn, you play with the patrons next turn. But the, the ghoul allows Sylvanas to actually have relevance on the board. Ah, uh, good point. And then also... Very good point, actually. Yeah. 
Okay. I think I think more. She, maybe she's yeah, like I worried thinking about the non attack. Scenario. Maybe she's also worried about um, quartermaster just like yeah, like, running her over. Oh that's, yeah, that's true. That's a uh, eleven, twenty, twenty one damage with the quartermaster, and then you also get a juggle, so she might cash in. Yep. Here we go. Cash it. No. Oh. Do we get cash? Well, that, I mean, that's definitely not the worst that one. That lets you melee the knife juggler? Yeah, you can kill the juggler, so you're good okay. to go. Now, let's see if we top deck Quartermaster on the other side. I mean, in this case, it, like, it's it's a big deal, but it's not like as game-winning as it could have been without taunts. Like, the slime really gives you a little bit more uh, maneuver as a warrior. How, how good is the Consecration here? I don't know. Let me hit up crew. It's decent. How good is... <laughs> how good is... How good is... Radio Kappa. Turns out it's pretty good. Yeah. Mm. The crit memes okay, so are just not think. as funny as they used to be. So, it's just a, it's the same. Shredder, Shredder, Minibot, Hero Power, and 5 5 into 3 3, 1 1, and face into slime and rest face. I mean, consecration consecration is a looks like it, it's a clear. The problem is you don't really and you get to do hit, anything. You get to hit face with Lothar. And, and then, you know you, what? Then. When they, what does suck though is even if you draw quality, you can't drink your patrons are. Yeah, that's true. That's the issue. Yeah, if you use constant, I think now I, you I, think I do. The... I shredder mini bot hero power. Yeah, there we go. But you're also about to hit a really bad time. Cause it's patron time. So I, I do always imagine it's kind of like one. the Power Rangers where they literally just whip out. With the, their patrons as if they're morphers or something. Hey, I thought weird. they were going somewhere else with they're going to whip out their... But I didn't know... Oh, yeah, we, we don't care about the, we don't we, care about we the one We whip our patrons back and forth. That's sorry, what we sorry. do here. We don't care about the one ones because of Death Bite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Death Bite. Uh, I'm spaced out. No worries, bro. Oh, I need tea or coffee. You think they'd bring me that? They totally would bring you that, Rickful. Do they know I haven't slept in <laughs> 24 hours? Players, are brother? we Valley Girls now? They totally would. <laughs> oh my god, totally. Totally. Yeah. Oh my god, that'd be, that'd be great. Wouldn't they be awesome? Like, I could totally commentate even though I haven't slept in 24 hours. You totally should. Like, oh my... Okay, I'm gonna shut up. Everyone just close the stream. Everyone, get out of here. Everyone's about to get in here. Well, I mean, technically, yeah. With a board like this, it's hard not to. Uh, yeah, and then she has Gromosh for potential finish if she ever gets the chance to. Because I was just counting like how much damage she had, which was uh, 19 out of 24. Pretty sick. All right, so Patron gets played. And uh, the ghoul. How will she sequence yeah. this? And do you play the ghoul? I mean, after all is said and done, probably the ghoul will be played at the end of the turn. Yeah. Um, the question is, like, what's the follow-up after? Pop everything. Yeah, almost certainly the ghoul. So... Yeah, that's gonna be really annoying without equality. This is a good turn to draw equality. I mean, explosive sheep from the shredder would be. No. Oh. <laughs> that's Wrecked. hilarious. That's the saddest quartermaster I've ever seen. Uh, I man. look pretty happy. The loneliest. The, yeah. the loneliest. Yeah. Nice. Forever alone. For All right. Well, uh, the consecration here. Will... Gonna, I mean, it will only create one patron. You'll have only one three-three patron at the end of that. Because you. No, it'll it'll have. Yeah, yeah, actually. You right. attack the like the ghoul with the weapon? No, it'll be a 3-3 three, three and a 3-2, right? Because it copies off the first one, and then the death battle happens. Well, no, because one of them dies, right? Right, but so the 3-3 three, three three comes out, and then it dies. And then oh, right, three, there'll two. be a 3-2 three, and a 3-3. Yeah. So then he has to kill the 3-3 three, three with it. And, right. then, and then get something with two attack. Blue chill, blue kill. Oh, uh, I was going to say blue chill. <laughs> blue, blue chill, yeti. Oh, blue yeah. chill warrior. Um, yeah, I mean, that sounds just about... The best not do. even hero power, not even once. Of That's immunity not. against uh, boom bots oh, and against multiple God. whirlwind okay, so effects. Doctor Boom is Dude. getting BGH. Yeah. Doesn't and matter. You have boom bots. The boom bots might kill the egg. Oh my God. I, but he's Lord. not gonna. He's not gonna hero power. So he's just like not gonna do any. Uh, well, he's gonna hero power when he plays quartermaster, right? So. Oh yeah, you're right. There's probably next turn even like two five. So that's like ten minutes. Right. Yeah, it makes sense. This is what. So the pally wants. Dr. Boom comes down. Melee of Boombot. Bam. Hits your egg. Right. B BGH that biatch. <laughs> <laughs> you almost stopped yourself, but you couldn't. Yeah, that was hard. It, it's good, it's good. Okay. And then take too much damage from Boombot. How Boombot come, when you, how you, come when you throw in one more letter, it's not a bad word? It doesn't make oh, any sense. That does nothing. It's not an O. <laughs> Where's uh, the O? No, hey, you could kill the patron with that, right? It's not that it does, it, it, it does something, for sure. <laughs> Later. <laughs> for that, is not sure what not it this does. this turn. Okay, let's see if it's egg. Bam. Yeah. Oh, wow. wow. But now the quality now. gets a lot worse. 
We're not using it right now, buddy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, here we go. Yeah, we love life. We love life. Life is everything not bad on the right board now. hits for harder. Life, life is pretty hype right now. But uh, Grom Hellscream, like, you might just be played for Temple here. Oh, oh wait, well, is that goodness. 15, 16. How much lethal? Hey, if Boombot hits four to the face, it's lethal, it's right? It's lethal, yeah, but you have 12, to. 12, 15, and four to the four. face. You definitely check. But uh, on the flip side, you also might die. Four to the face, one out of five, then one out of four, one out of 20. Yeah, I don't think that's 5%. 5% lethal. Is, yeah. Let's do it. 5% lethal. <laughs> no, I mean, why, let's throw the move on it. Come on, man. This is all the stream. If this it happens. It's, it's also good revenge very against hyper. Vortex, who did the same exact thing to her with yeah, the Boobots. Yeah, with the Boobots like, really. Lethal. Come on, let's do it. Please. Uh -huh. It's not happening. Dude, I'm, getting the, I'm getting butterflies. I mean, I mean she's getting probably going to just interrage the patron, probably, in the trade. But I don't know. We'll see. Gamba! Gamba! Pretty no! Gamba! Oh, uh, it's a trade with the Gromon. No, well, you have to Gamba first. If he throws the Boombot in now and hits forward to the face, we're going to be really pissed. Yeah. We'll be really sad. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> everyone held their, everyone held their breath. Dude, we got really hyped for just a second, <laughs> okay. man. It was pretty nuts. Yeah, that was a mistake. Okay, a little mistake there, though. For sure, you throw it in for. All right. I guess. Okay. I mean, I guess not really, because it could hit it the four-four. It could hit four. the four-four that you were gonna but kill anyway. Still, you yeah, know. Come on. Wow. Wow. Interesting. Yeah. That becomes a five-five, and now you don't have the equality. Although you could still equality. That's a fight you, you don't want the patron to beat that with. The problem is you have to kill Gromash and the patron simultaneously, so you equality now. Yeah. I mean, it becomes you... a 5 1, do you care? Yeah. Like, no, uh, it becomes a 5-3. A a and then you uh, kill it off. Oh, you're talking about the patron. Yeah, I, yeah I'd probably sorry. just go face at this point with my guys. Wait, like, so after buffing them? I really have to pee. Okay. Can I go right now? Well, just don't stay in your pajamas. You only got one pair. <laughs> I'll play your mom. Thank, thank you for sharing, Rifle. Yeah. Wait, I have to. What do I do? You just whip out your patron. <laughs> whip my patron back and forth. Mm. You know, uh, Eloise, I thought maybe this was a good matchup, but it's looking pretty awkward to finish it here. It's like, uh, well, she didn't draw anything to activate patron for a long time, remember? Right, she had both of them. Two deaths by two whirlwinds, no, didn't draw any of that. So. But Paladin's also... No, but yeah, had she gotten that... A couple turns earlier, Paladin had no way but, to deal with it. Yeah, there was no way to, to actually deal with it because equality came in very late, ultimately, right? Mm -hmm. Like, and even then, there was no board. Oh, well, that that'll wow. still do it. it no, it but the, the problem works. with that is that the quartermaster just kills the second patron. But the one wrong. of them, I guess. Can, I mean, I guess you don't even have to use your whirlwind at this point. Then Wait, you just so play you, you just play patron armor yeah, up. Yeah, and fast, patron right? armor up is. Probably good enough because the outcome would be the same either way. As long as he does two then, silver. What do you, what do you silver. really want to draw? The, what do you want to draw on the other side? Uh, you want to draw uh, the second death bite? You want to draw the second well. Uh, we have second death bite, right? Or ghoul? Yeah, second death bite would be pretty big. Ghoul's good. Okay, so it's clear that this patron's going to get copied, but do you do you care because it's attacking a two health minion, so it's creating one three ones? No. Well, if he uses hero power, he's giving. Oh wow, that's it. That's going to give uh, four wow. patrons. Well, that's yeah. It's patron town. Patron it's time. patron time. Oh, there's the death spike. Wow, perfect outcome. Wow. Oh Pretty my nice. god, you get to death She's shaking spike. her head. She's, She's like, like, this is so dirty. <laughs> oh yeah, death spike, that guy feels good, man. And all of a sudden, this game just got blown wide open. And I think there's only one equality because we didn't see an equality the In other before game. Tyrion, the Tyrion is out then to really like stop this right now. Right. Um, otherwise, there's just going to be more of those. No, Belcher's just off. Belcher's bad. Yeah. I think that's game. Not yet. I mean, it's not game right now, yeah. but I think it's game. Because, uh, let's see. I'm, I'm trying to think, like, if it, Paladin can come back from this position at all. Yeah, no, equality, even if you get Tyrion, they'd kill you the next turn. It would have, have to be some, another equality. Right. Because they have enough patience to just flood the board. and then Yeah. Enter. <laughs> just pass. That's what you do. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. What? Okay, well, that's gonna go. That's gonna go splendidly. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> I mean, at this point, um, as the pilot, you're just looking for something to answer this. And outside of Tyrion, I don't think there is. Maybe, maybe but, like, if he had Tyrion, Sylvanas. Next, Tyrion next turn is too late. If now. he had Sylvanas, maybe that was the way to, to do it. And you were just saying how uh, this matchup was gonna be bad and stuff? No, I was saying no, no, it was no, just, no, the, just like it got really awkward. It did awkward. get awkward that moment yeah. after yeah. the equality, yeah. 
I'll tell you. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't Thanks, mean to, didn't mean to call bro. you out there. I didn't mean to call you out there. No, it's cool, bro. I did I mean to call you out there. Yeah, Let's yeah, be yeah. honest. Everybody. <laughs> uh, no no discount on Corsair. Not that it matters. Um, no, nah, even the You'd rather have a board of patrons. And you can have the 3-2 uh, attack in. Or maybe like, kill off the 3-1, because you don't want to like weaken too much. It doesn't really Yeah. Matter. Might trade it away. Actually, you do want to kill a 3-1. You, you want to keep the board uh, as big as possible. Like you want, you want, uh, you don't, you want space for patient to copy. You like bearded men that replicate. Okay, well, consecration actually almost works out, much, but, but yeah. it'll clear something. Just this does not work you're, out. You're guys. Still Can dead. you guys? Let's be honest. There's yeah. four patients right at the end of this. Yeah, there's four patients. Yeah. Right so. Rest in peace. Well, uh, that's a that's a is a two one now, dude. These series are are really close. Pretty close. Uh, and remember, the winner of this goes to the round of 16. That this is like fun. elimination. That was pretty fun. Game. That, was a, that was a good game, yeah. Sometimes there's a blowout, either way. All Dude. right. So they Oh, go. no, no. Actually, we're mad. Didn't go for the 5% boom bot. Oh, yeah. That's oh, right. yeah. We're pissed. Yeah. We're well, pissed. Uh, I mean, I'm pretty sure this is going to go to game five, by the way, because um, now the, the control warrior <laughs> queues up into the patron, uh, smacks that down. With the the force of a thousand armor ups, and then we have <laughs> a thousand hours. You mean <laughs> more like? Yeah. Oh my god! And then we have uh, the the hunter versus the warrior. <laughs> you can go pee. You should go pee now. Yeah. You should if you're gonna do it, All just right. do it now. I hope this doesn't hurt everyone's ears. Later. Yeah. Right, so Rekfuls, uh going to the bathroom, changes changes pajamas. Yeah. All right. Uh, so we got warrior versus the warrior. Oh. Later, dude. I keep forgetting they come back to camera to switch between overlays and stuff. Yeah. I just, I just get too comfortable. Yeah. All right. All right, so this is... Uh, this is a good opening hand yeah. for Vortex. He's got two death spites and weapons so he can deal with early game stuff. He's playing a very greedy deck, and there's not that many answers in Patron anyway. Um, right. Like, what are the odds that the Patrons snowball out of control? Like, there would have to be absolutely no brawl, which was just picked up, so... It's gonna be even 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 then the the patron is just like a sideways right. pressure. You don't expect it to win straight up. Yeah, it's more of a it's kind of like your gimmick. Mm -hmm. um, they slap on top of a combo deck. Yeah, this is already again a tough matchup, so it's like not really anticipating it to do very well. Hey, uh, Take just walked into the building. By the way, Guten Tag. All right. Uh, so, uh, you know, taking he was at BlizzCon, just chilling. And came all the way up. Yeah, he did. A lot of people traveled. So, uh, Eloise went for attack there, and I'm kind of wondering if maybe she should have taken time to develop something like Cool Taskmaster instead, but I think it's okay to just set up a weapon instead. Yeah, would, like, I was going to say, you're probably happy to play a weapon. Uh, you can check for Harrison Jones by using the War Axe, or just because there's no patron, there's no hurry to get the Death Bite out. So you just, like, exhaust the charges on this. Um, yeah, Fiery War Axe against um, Vortex's deck is not going to be too productive. Yeah. The Sludge Belcher here is kind of what she was expecting, but not really happy to see still. Vortex is drawing very well in this game for Yeah. Welcome back, Red Bull. Trying not to hurt anyone's ears. Okay. I gotta put my feet back up. How how is your bathroom trip? Oh, you come on, man. Oh man. You didn't like it? <laughs> Noxious is closing the shop. He says no fine. legs on I'm my good. lap. It's comfy, no, it's fine. It's fine. It's I don't cool. give a fuck. I see how it is. As long as we have like, I put my feet on Frodo. Oh, yeah, so, we, so we just have a lap train? For you, you don't get to, anybody. Yeah. So the question is, whose lap do I put my legs on? That's the, what I'm saying. Lothar looks pretty lonely. He's a little far, too. Yeah. Lothar, we need your lap. <laughs> Ooh. Can, we, can we borrow Ooh, your baby. loins, Lothar? He said, hey, sure. Hey, Lothar. Great. Hey, Lothar. Hey, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pro dad. I just wanted to let you know. All right. Oh, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Death Spite. We're hitting that. It, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't yeah, matter. Same, same armor, same armor. Which, again, armor doesn't really truly matter here. Wait, it's not the same armor, because, like, um, <laughs> the armor that's made first is usually worth a bit more. Because yep. there's not as much of it. Dude, I have to say, man, Vortex's deck is pretty sick. 
Yeah, he said that I feel very confident, and he did beat a control mirror match, right? Which we kind of expect well, because it's greedy. It's one of the greediest right. decks out there, but yeah, it's still um, just then a far in. It's, a, it's really abusing the, the meta, it seems, because nothing's fast enough that you're going to yeah. be... Like, there's no zoo. I haven't seen a zoo well, today, really. the Hunter might be able to be great right. enough. He has to draw just like this, Armorsmith, Weapons, Cool Task, Bash, against Hunter. He has to do it twice. Against Patron, though, he's got, like, all the time in the world. Uh, yeah. Well, at least a lot more time. Yeah. What do you do? Set up Death Spite now? Like, chop this down, set up Death Spite? Feels... So, like, just so bad to try to go for this specifically. It's just a bunch of spells. Ghoul, cool, fast, yeah. power, rage. Looking at the brawl already in hand, it feels pretty hopeless. Yeah. You know when you finally make the patrons? Yeah, you're hoping they didn't draw it. Yeah. Well, it's like you're one out. Patrons is just something on the side. The thing that you care about the most is, like, just board presence in general. Yeah, but you don't have anything for that either. Yeah, you just have spells. You, like, you don't have shredders. Or... Just sets up the weapon. If... Harrison Jones comes down, so be it. Not a great matchup, anyways. Oh, was there Harrison Pro Jones? I already, uh... already saw the deck. In this I game. didn't see. We, Harrison we Jones. know. Okay. But um, Eloise also didn't look at Vortex. His full deck, I think. During oh, she fell asleep. She during fell the game. asleep. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's right. The, as, the, as the, did the, IRL, else. the IRL fatigue. Yeah. There it is. It's sad that it's not even role play. It's actually like it happens. What is going on? All right. It's just like all spells. And what's funny is that uh, with this deck, too, it's like you want to be so minion-based, you just use the spells to help you synergize with it. This armor the Control Warrior is getting is actually relevant. Yeah, it is going to be a lot. And, uh, I mean, these other, other Warriors to rush you down. I say rush because... <laughs> Quote-unquote, yeah. rush. <laughs> yeah. He's going to punch you very slowly until you die, but... Um, there was a time when Warrior could do it. I, I mean, they can technically still do it, but oh. as long as... Uh, oh, I want to see what that comes out bad. of that. Come oh. on, Ben Brode. What, what, what's the best second brawl? No, you don't even need it. Pyroblast. Pyroblast? That's not good. What? Well, why not? It's too slow. It's awesome. Flame Strike. <laughs> Flame Strike would be sick. That's funny. Oh. Light Bomb. Come on, let's do it. I want to see. I want to see like. No, a, I, want I want to see, like, see twisting nether. I, I want to see like tree of life. Oh my god! Well, we didn't drop it just because it does the axe, but yeah. we don't get to see the fun. Oh no, that's lame. We'll get to see the fun later. Oh, speaking of fun, the fun, fun police fun, just arrived. Fun. Yeah. Doctor Boom. All right, and then we're pressing shield slam. And okay, so let's. We're, we're trying to get him to melee the armor smith. Then we press shield slam. Doctor Boom, Nexus champion, hero power. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then pick up another shield slam for later from the Nexus champion. That's the <laughs> Yeah. He just keeps drawing shield slams. So first armor up will give force of nature, the second one will give savage roar. Oh, so he's not going armor smith. You want to save the death she, she, she. Sorry. She, yeah, yeah, yeah. She wants yeah, to save stop, it for her. Stop being so sexist. Yeah, Elois needs to it's stop. Actually, though. isn't it the opposite? <laughs> if I can't... If people say girl gamers are bad, right. I can't even tell that it's a girl. That's r now you're just being rude. No, but you don't understand it. You can't win the argument because nope. if you don't think it's a girl, then you're like not recognizing the fact that she's got a gender of her own. Wow. Uh, did we do those boom bots? We did wow. the damage boom bots. Wait, we did those. Guess what happens? Sorry, didn't we do those armor? <laughs> what the? Oh, okay, my something bad. just my fell. Bad. Didn't we do those armor smith attacks in the wrong order? No, I'm really tired. The Red Bulls. Hey guys, we, we're gonna have trouble selling out from this point on, guys. Armor smith attacks. Oh, give geez. the the monitor wings. I, I actually literally just ruined everything. Okay, if you got uh, they they dropped the monitor we're watching. That's okay. why we're, yeah, we're yeah. half AFK right now. Yeah. All right, uh, a lot of spells, literally all spells, no minions. Okay. All right, we're back. We're back. Yeah, there's no like, there's a whirlwind. So technically, like removing this is kind of easy. The question is like, what's my follow up as far as aggression goes? And there's like nothing. Taskmaster, execute. Just wow. take your time. I feed armor to the warrior too. Like it keeps just stacking. I mean, those boom bots you could wait technically until uh, you get patrons. Maybe you could abuse them somehow. Yeah, I mean that that is her hope here. Primarily, it's just patrons. But with that brawl waiting since turn four, it's yeah. gonna be a hard time coming. Also, Vortex refuses to swing with his weapon ever. Just a four-two chilling. Oh, four damage boom bot. There it is. This is not Fatigue Warrior, but it's close enough. It's a really good feeling. 
play a control where it gets like this. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> There's like I, nothing I, they can do, right? I yeah. Okay, unless, second unless death you fight. don't draw brawl, but yeah, you just look how comfortable he feels. So there. why why not like I would hate death to fight while using the Gromosh and just battle rage, just draw deeper in your deck. Yeah, you can draw two cards right away. So. Like screw it, just go for it. Find the patience right now because you've got the whirlwind still in your hand with the ghoul. Um, yep. And you really need to, to to bait the first ball and get the second wave of patience to stick. Because if that doesn't happen, then you're pretty much nowhere. Yeah, agreed. Has the face, shuts him down to oh my God. 41 All the way health. down to 41. Yeah. How's he going to recover from that? Oh, here comes his spell. Shield block. He, just, just to like rub it in. He could have checked that spell first. Let's oh. see might? He actually could have. Yeah, yeah. I'm not sure you would have used it, but... Wait, that's BGH synergy. Yeah, it's got the BGH synergy. Value. Oh my God. Yeah. So how much you bet we're going to see a Paladin come out of the next expansion using the, you know, turn things into 3-3s, three Aldor Peacekeeper, Humility, Blessing of Might, BGH. Yep. It's going to be like sense. the attack manipulation there. All right. Here comes Patron. And then Rage here comes the Brawl. Whirlwind. I mean, another Patron Whirlwind turn would do a lot. Like, if she picks up another one off the top, then I think there's a chance right. that... Uh, yep, I mean, yep. there is that board flood possibility. Definitely, yeah. Yeah, she does have Enrage and Whirlwind ready, and even Deathsbite. But and, I mean, with, the, acolyte, with the Bash and the Weapon and the Cruel Task, you're taking care of three of them already. Yeah, he might feel like he doesn't even need to. Just, yeah, but I think true. it's safer just to He's to thinking brawl. about it. It's safer to Brawl. Yeah. And and you, you, you still keep the same options for later. Yeah, you so. Brawl, and, you, and then you can like Bash whatever comes out. If you bash weapon, cool task, you still leave this very small remote possibility that more Everything, patrons come out. Yeah, I mean, there is a death bite setup, so yeah. you would allow uh, Eloise to get more, and then you have to use Brawl to compensate for that. So might as well just smack whatever comes out. Oh, the 5 1. Uh, use might cool want to use cool test here. Although that does mean that Eloise will have uh, a better chance of getting a second wave of patrons to stick around, because that's one less source of removal from the. Sort of, but the, I mean, the, the, the cool Taskmaster will take out a one health patron anyways and won't copy. So, Taskmaster here, shut it down. It's fine. It's the same difference either way. Yeah. I think you just, you save the weapon no, she, for like the, She really attack. needs patron here. Yeah, she needs to find it. If not, like, oh. not right now, then in by two turns. Uh, I can let a pain play here, 100%. Okay, BGH for Nefarian. That's yeah. a good pickup. Acolyte and the Unstable Ghoul in tandem. Yeah, you keep the whirlwind, keep the inner rage for that last patron. The last push. It, is, it really is a last hope in many ways. Ooh. Okay, so, okay. I mean, the ghoul whirlwind death bite should be enough from her perspective. And I don't think she's that wrong on the... On the well, it maximizes the draw potential. You just play... How many cards left in deck? I missed that. Uh, I, I didn't see. Yeah, she must be about 10 at this point, right? With the double, uh, I mean, the battle rage she played. Maybe a bit more, 12. Unstable Ghoul feels like it would draw out the weapon hit, too. Yeah. Oh, nine cards. All right. So she is at uh, the sub-10. I, I like that Vortex has really been trying to hold on to uh, this weapon hit as much as he can. Wow. Okay. So she's going to count on the Ghoul to... Oh! oh Hatron. Okay. That's getting really interesting, though. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm interested that she went on to use the death fight immediately to get the other card. Yeah, of a stable goal. Yeah, Damn. she would have drawn it next turn. But that's a pretty never know. crazy turn. Oh, oh my God! Revenge and brawl. Are you kidding? Me? Wow. Yeah. All right, so now it's over. Yeah, it, there's just no way. We can pretend it's brawl. not over, but it's over. Yeah. <laughs> Even with the VGH, it doesn't matter. Yeah, because uh, boom and everything's been used, right, Gomash? So Dude. it's like, you need patrons. It's like, that's your only way to win. Maybe we believe in Sylvanas. Uh, no. No. Okay. That Sylvanas is going to do fi for 48 damage? <laughs> 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 Let's go, Sylvanas. You're depressing me, Rifle. No, I'm sorry, man. It's okay. I just like to keep it real, you know? Yeah, put the feet on the lap and then just... Uh, well, um, maybe, maybe you can start by, uh, by drawing. If you want to. I mean, this is a tough position. I still don't even know what's the right answer if I was in Meloise's spot. 
probably end up just BGH and then... Seeing, like, because the weapon hits, then, probably going to uh, be drawn by that. And just passing, yeah. Yeah. Because the problem is if you develop Sylvanas... What if you go BGH, Sylvanas? But then Sylvanas just potentially could die with nothing on the board, and you need Sylvanas to kind of do stuff. Yeah. Like you need, because you know the deck's really greedy, so you just need it. You're gonna pick up something eventually, right? And then now, uh, Vortex. Eh, BJ doesn't really do much. I mean, now he's dipping uh, below 40 health. He might. He has to be really scared. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think, Redful? He's so scared. <laughs> Uh, he, is, he does look a little stressed too. He could bash himself. For exactly nothing? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you do lose three mana. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess you, you're right. Just pass! Alright, so. He's playing the Control Warrior game like very well, so. Can't blame him. That brawl, though. That brawl. Uh, even without that brawl. I mean, yeah, you, you, they, he does have the weapon hit, and he's got the bash. Like, he's got enough health that he could have maybe just played Sylvanas. And, de like, diffused the uh, yeah. patron bomb, I guess. Quick question. What's up? Something interesting, actually. Go. Okay. If Sylvanas was played, and you might it, and BGH it, does it actually steal the BGH? It doesn't, right? Actually, yes, it does. But doesn't that isn't that different than SI agent Mad Scientist Mirinity? Because the battle cry activates before the death rattle. Yeah, so you know, you know, if, if you SI a Mad Scientist, the Mad Scientist death rattles first, and then the copies are Mad Scientist. Right. Yeah, I mean, the copies, copies are your SI. Your SI, yeah. So if you do the same by the same logic, yeah, but they the, shouldn't the, get your BGH. Right? The order yeah. of effect is actually that it triggers, oh. but the minion is still considered in Wait. play for the sake of things that interact with it, like wild power. Say say you BGH a Death Lord is like super big, and you spawn a uh, like I don't know a minion that when it comes into play. I knew damage. you would know. The the answer to this. Yeah, well, it'll still, you know, uh, trigger whatever comes out of it. It's kind of silly, but... Oh, yeah, it, doesn't, it doesn't seem to, uh, it's to make not, sense. It's not, yeah, it's not very you, consistent. You think about the, uh, That's the, the reason there's a guy, you know, who's doing Hearthstone science, right? Publishing <laughs> the results of that stuff everywhere. Yeah, I guess um, so. Oh, Shredder's not a bad draw, but uh, at least is uh, kind of in trouble here. All right. Um. The only thing that could make, uh, like, could make it so, well, never mind. I was gonna say Eloise, you know, doesn't lose this is uh, if somehow Savance is misplayed by uh, Vortex, whereby he plays his own and then right. butchers every line of play possible. Um, I mean, we've seen people do stuff like that before. Yeah, but it's happened. Like, it, Savance is the kind of minion that you think you have a good play with, and sometimes you just don't think it through enough, and yeah, it's over. Well, got to do what you got to do. Execute and just start hoping that eight power on the board is enough. I, I'm, <laughs> but uh, at the same time, with Sylvanas challenging the board, that's pretty tough. What you need to do here is give uh, the warrior Wrathguard from a Shredder that he steals with Sylvanas. Then you armor up, right. armor up, armor up, and shield slam for four. But she got the warrior under 30 health. Yeah, that's impressive. We're making progress. Okay. Okay. Uh, Vortex... Bashing onto. Oh man, back above 30. <laughs> there it is. Wow. Never lucky. So she's also stuck with the coin. She hasn't been able to use it all game. Battle Rage for <laughs> one. <laughs> Amazing card. She might hold on to it. She is very determined, though. I would have, I would have just bailed out of there a long time ago. Escape concede. I mean, it's also one of those things where maybe she's using the time to get to know the deck a little bit more. Mm. Whoa. All right, boys, this game just got really long. Really long. Because the warrior, the warrior on Vortex side is 30 far from killing. Oh, wait, never mind. She's almost out of cards. Hey, it can't that. last that long now, can it? No, and then Battle Rage draws the last card. And then she just knows she can't win. All right, so does she press concede here? Or does she keep on trucking with that for that last card? What do you think is the last card? Um, Dr. Boom. No, we've already seen Shredder. Okay. Shredder. Yeah, Shredder number two, I think. That's, That's my guess. probably a good guess. Unless she's not playing two of them. People thought it was weird I asked about the uh, might be GH, but if you guys know about the uh, SI, SI, the yeah. SI Mad Scientist thing, then it makes sense because that Mad Scientist actually death rattles but, and but, then copies your SI. But the SI is not a battle cry. Is it? It's well, it, it works that, like mechanically it's still the same thing though. So the game treats it the same way. Like if you were to BGH a Mad Scientist, you would still get give them a copy of BGH. 
Really? Yeah, it's, it's weird, huh? Yeah, it's kind of weird. But you so would, then, so you, you wouldn't, wouldn't steal Savon. Isn't that? No, there's. He's saying they that would it would Savon. steal, but it and it also mirrored to go off, which seems contradictory, right? Oh, yeah. It's consistent it sounds like, with a, it sounds like a video some content creators could create and then whine about our stuff. Hey guys, I was checking out this thing and it's really weird how it works differently in these two situations. Dude, why are you hating on people? <laughs> oh, <laughs> Rex You like that? Dude, you're so mean. I'm not mean, it's man. Just our YouTube you're channel, brutal. Man. No, that's a, that's my real voice. I just pretend I have this voice when I'm oh, commenting. Oh, I see how it hey. is. Hey, hey guys. Hey, second shutter. Hey, Frodan. Yo. What's up? I'm going to have Frodan voice now. This is my new voice. All right. It's, it's, a pretty it sol it's a pretty solid program. Oh, yeah, that's right. Sit up. <laughs> hey, guys. Yeah, stop showing off. Um, welcome back to the PJ stream. Uh, we really enjoyed that game, yeah. I haven't seen many Control that's Warrior. Exactly I, I haven't seen sound. many, like, Warrior Mirror matches today, at least, so. Oh, we got um, Warrior versus Hunter. Yeah, and uh, this matchup we get really quick. Wow, that's a really good opening hand from uh, from the, the okay. Warrior. Just needs fire war axe. Uh, I feel set. really bad for E. Lewis. E. Lewis is gonna have to find. Uh, you have to. You have to play against the control where, and they have. That's cool. Good. That's kind of a decent start, though. Yeah, it's all right. You need like cool. a top deck. But, I mean, that's kind of what it want wanted to do. But like, it's just so amazing that um, Vortex's deck is so greedy, yet it's able to still survive some of this aggressiveness. Yeah, it was. I think it would have a lot of trouble against Secret Valley or Zoo. Um, Maybe not but Secret yeah, Valley necessarily, why banned, but that's why he bans the Paladin. Right, exactly. He doesn't expect both to show up, so he bans whichever of those he, he thinks is going to be there. Um, and a lot of the Hunters are going you know, hybrid with a lot of uh, the aggressive stuff. Sure. So he can abuse that with the Ghouls. Yeah, he's got a pretty good deck. I like it. All right, Elias has a pretty decent curve. Now, one thing that can change it is the dynamic of how the high main works. Um, the last two draws from Vortex aren't very good. He's still looking for weapons. And if this is Huffer, then it's one of those things where actually it's not too bad at all for Eloise. Because then you can kill the armor smith almost immediately. Boom. Oof. Never look. Yeah. That, that's actually really tough because it's like the worst outcome. Acolyte is... All right, well, he didn't draw Death's not, back not there. The best. You could probably just act like... Uh, well, you don't want to execute this if you know there's high mains. But at the same time... No, you probably want to play Acolyte. Yeah. But on Stable Ghoul, you can also make a case for him. No, you just play Acolyte. I mean, with Brawl, I feel like it doesn't matter what happens, right? Like, you always have that entrance. Mm -hmm. If something goes really, really all right, then... As the Hunter, at least... At least, uh... You're happy the Warrior didn't have Coin Death by there, and you, you feel so hopeless. Right. Kills, it kills your Leoc, then it's yeah. also going to kill the, the spawn Death Rattle of your Spider later. So do you go for, like, an Iron Beak on the, uh, the Acolyte, and then you kill the Armor Smith with your two minions and quick shot the Acolyte? Or is that too much of an all-in, and you're damaging your stuff when you don't have to? Yeah, I, I definitely would kill Armor Smith because it's coming up on the Coin Belcher turn. Um, I probably develop Scientist instead, instead of, of the Owl. Instead of the Owl, it's okay if the Acolyte draws a card. You just don't want it to draw two cards, I think. Fire War Axe comes in, but it's it's already like a little bit late. It's, it's gonna, gonna kill Leog, though. It's so amazing. It's good on and it can also just you know that justify playing the Ghoul. Leog is four damage right now. You only take two to kill it. Not bad. That's why Leoc is no Huffer. That's right. So if you play the Ghoul here, Le you can Le set up like a clean brawl. Captain no of what. the chess club, and then, like Huffer was a football player. Yeah. <laughs> he just runs in. Yeah. <laughs> He's just the linebacker, always gets the girls. Leoc's the guy that like takes you know the girl home to stream with him, but uh, ultimately. Don't you guys get this, this? Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Uh, right. All right. Well, uh, do you do unstable cool here? Do I think so because you pop the spider and it, like the AOE triggers after it spawns the, the, the spider, so you're forcing him to have um, either a bow or quick shot number two or owl, I guess. Happy and stable cool. Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys get a happy, peaceful feeling looking at this warrior? These, like, if you were playing the warrior right now, you feel so confident, you're just chilling. Yeah. But um, I mean, this is definitely still. Doable. Just the only problem is that it's starting to develop into power turns for Warrior and Warrior's still have full health against Hunter yeah. and can coin Justicar maybe or something. Um, and then later can can hit something in Brawl. Yeah, maybe even yeah, just probably just Brawl makes the most sense. Yeah. The only thing is if Brawl is used and then right afterwards the high main comes down, um, it's a bit tricky. Right, and also uh, Vortex has information on like the traps from Eloise. He saw a snake trap earlier. So uh, that that dynamic changes a lot. When you, you, can, know. you can hold on the brawl, wait on the brawl a little bit. What do you really want, like a Belcher this turn, a top deck? You rather play? 
the trades. Is it a Belcher? He's gonna. He's thinking about coin just wow. looks like. Oh, play all the traps, stop deck and bow. I mean, this looks looks like an opportunity for you to brawl. Mm. Yeah, I don't think you're gonna get a better one with two cards left in hand. I'm greedy, man. I, I coin Jessica. The only problem with brawl is that if you brawl and one scientist, you know, scientists die, um, whatever's left, you have, like, if you attack it, it's you true. don't have, like, a one damage AoE. The thing to kill is, snakes. I guess you probably aren't getting a hero power next turn. Yeah, he's still gonna do it. He's on my team. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's, it's perfectly mm -hmm. fine, but I think brawl is also a case. The only problem is that if you know Snake Trap is up and it activates and then you attack something with the weapon afterwards. I think Bam. The, yeah, there's a big upside, too, to playing Justice Guard now is that if there's a high mate, it'll come out before you brawl or Bite gets caught into it. That is true. So just for that alone, it might be uh, worth considering. Freezing Trap is not a good draw considering you have two scientists out. Yeah. But you could use it on Justice Guard if she's trying to attack at all. Um, yeah. Noxious, you're the only one who would say she there. That's awesome. Now, I know it's a she. Yeah. Froden would have said he, right? I, or I it. definitely would have. Yeah. That would have been a big misplay. You RP, Noxious. I RP. And I appreciate it. I do that all the Let's time. Let's play Arma. <laughs> uh, oh, snap. Don't listen to him, man. He'll kill you every time. In Arma? <laughs> I love RP. It's all I, I do. do. In a stormwind, like near the fountain, I just like... Just dance. I take out my, my gnome. Now, you know what I like to do? Listen to this. You go to Moonguard, you go to the inn. The Goldshire. Goldshire, man. Moonguard server. Yeah, yeah, the server. Yeah, you, you go, go to the Goldshire. Yeah, you go to the inn. Oh, yeah. Take everything off. Everything. You go, go to the go to the, uh, the basement. Right. Everything. Slash dance. A lot of stuff is going down <laughs> in that basement. <laughs> a lot. I'm happy. Oh, my God. I'm happy do you realize Noxious is above the age of 18, right? So it kind of ruins it, the, the uh, mystery really? for you. Ah, okay. Aquil's not interested anymore. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, not a little girl. Well, uh, give up the coins. We can't boom. Is this the time to brawl? He doesn't know that uh, what the trap this is. I think right. this is snake trap, though. I mean, See, this is what we were talking about, it's though. It's a coin flip, right? I was saying, even though I kind of felt like Justice Karin, yeah, I was saying, you're probably not going to hear about the very next turn, but it's fine. I mean, if you so, attack the uh, the Shredder and it is Snake Trap, then you, you get the perfect you brawl. You get a really right? nice brawl. Like, you you know. attack Shredder and brawl. Yeah. Or I don't. You could be greedy and Belcher, but I don't know. I don't see the point because you then Belcher you really want to play. Smith later. And it's, right. Belcher Armor Smith has good synergy. Yeah, because you really want to play that boom on on, turn, on next turn ideally. And if we if, look at, oh, oh my god! god. And look at if you look at her hand, she has no minions, so it's over. Well, what well, if Whirling Zappomatic comes out? Savannah Jaime. Oh my god, if it lives. That's not bad That's at all. That's pretty cool. That's kind of like you played just a car yourself. Come on, live. You fallen hero, you must live! Oh! The owl beast. It's well, a beast. It's, it's a beast. Yeah. Beast all right, she needs to draw a minion this turn, though. That's us Savannah Jaime. Dr. Balanced. Oh, juggle. Well, that's a minion, and uh... Yeah. It's, it's you're, start, you're gonna start getting armor up for four and a belcher, so it feels bad, but eh, there's a chance. There's a tiny chance. I'm I mean, not gonna say there's no below, chance. Below halfway point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually like this. Just do it now while you have a slight chance. Yeah, the beast might die. Okay, okay. Oh. See, it looks really scary oh. for the warrior, but it's not as scary it's, as a, it's, it's not even seems. close to being really yeah. scary. You have a belcher. That thing has seven health. And you armor up. And then you Tank. armor up for oh. four. So you gain 11 health this turn, sort of. Honestly, without Jesticar, this game could definitely be doable for the, the hunter. The, hi the high may need to be drawn that turn. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, wait. Quick Second shot is quick a card. Well, I mean, you can't just hit face with it. Oh, he can't. Oh, wait. He, he can't wait to go. He's like, I'm, I'm ready to punch my ticket to round 16. I'm ready to press armor up. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, for no you are so salty. No, I'm not. No, I, I would play this too. Would you do, uh, would you do quick shot onto the Belcher? Yeah. I, mm -hmm. I feel like, but the thing is, you're damaging your juggler by doing that, right? Because there's a. Leopard, no. Like, you're looking already oh, at the man. freezing trap. See, now you're going to get punished by Armorsmith. Well, oh, she's going all no, in on drawing because, second owl? No, because the, there's a freezing trap, so the Belcher can't attack. You, you don't know, need to attack, man. The point man. is, you just you wait. You don't attack you as out, a warrior. You literally <laughs> outpace the Are you the crazy? You just outpace the hunter by hero power. It's just so sad. Like, okay. hypothetically, this game goes long enough. Okay, 11 don't. health. There's no way. There's top no way. Owl. There, it's impossible. I mean, owl would be, like, the top deck. Oh, you fine. still don't kill with top deck owl. Okay. Because 11, the other person has 9. They're not dead, no. But, like, what about a quick shot top quick deck? Quick shot into face, owl. Quick yeah. shot face into owl. That'd be insane. No, no, she already played two quick shots. Oh, did she? Oh, yeah, she quick shot a minion. Uh, Acolyte. Yep. Turn 4. Oh, you're right. So it's over. Yeah. Feels uh, bad. Rip. Let's oh. be honest. Okay, so... Being honest. This has to... Oh, man. This is just so when the arm, It feels so bad when the armor starts ticking around. Like... 
Yeah, you just I can't get it you off. You knife, and then it's just yeah. armor, and then hidden armor, hidden armor. Dude, this is twice where it's like Eloise has gotten like a, a two one lead, and then loses twice to Vortex, and it's like getting really uh, close on game five. Had she banned a warrior? What do you think? Uh, it would have, I mean, the then priest is a problem, but the thing is, I can't imagine this priest is like any more greedy than the warrior, and Justicar doesn't exist in priest. Uh, you'll just run into a lot of Novas, right? Like, and that's going to cause you problems as well. The same weaknesses kind of apply. Or similar weaknesses, at least. Yeah, I guess so. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, oh, that's good. Pretty good juggle. It's the face, at least. Now the I mean, the dream is not dead. Oh, this is, no. You get all the armor from this whirlwind. Yeah. Kabam, you get a lot bam, bam, bam. And then you execute the goal. And then you, you armor up for four. It always well, what looks if, like. What if, it, the armor, what if the arcane golem survives, though? It always. He, well, if executes, not used. He can still execute it, but oh, it, it you're died. Right. It did die. But right. yeah. It always looks like it's wow. so close, but you're just so far. Yeah, now you're back up to 13. 13. Tank up. Tank up is a pretty good button. Turns out. Yeah, it's Savannah pretty High good. Main doesn't do anything here. Pretty good. That's like in my shaman, you know. In fact, I, um, you almost it. are dead because of Gromash. Mm. Yeah. What kills you? Cruel Task? Yeah, Cruel Task does. Ka boom, boom. Oh my god, just play that, play that. It's so BM. Shield Maiden. No, Shield Maiden Armor. Shield Maiden Armor? <laughs> just go back. Shield Maiden Armor up. Do it. It's demoralizing. Shield Maiden, oh no, Shield Maiden, and then. And he's thinking, right? Like, pretending he's like he, yeah. <laughs> This is a hard one. <laughs> like, there's a decision to make. Eloise is just crossing her arms. You're like, okay, come back on. Back to 20. I think she knows that this is, only, this is pretty much Press over. armor up. I want to be back at 20. More health than the hunter. <laughs> 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 come on. Uh, let's press it, press it, press it. Yeah. Uh, oh, there we yeah. go. 20 health. They yeah. need to make an anti-armor tech card, by the way. Um, I'm surprised we Dude, don't have a Kazan Mystic that steals the armor and gives it Not to you. Not even like, just Dude, a, imagine just like a stealth minion. Steals the armor and hits the face with it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Shield slams in her face. It's called like melt <laughs> armor. It's a hunter shot. It's like yeah. melting shot. Finally, shield slam face is real. Yeah, yeah there it is. All right, well, Vortex advances and eliminates Eloise. So that means Vortex and uh, RDU, RDU advance from way. Group B. They are two of our first people over. Ooh. And Vortex performed pretty good. All right, all right. We'll move over. Oh, oh man. don't don't I'm leave. Not, okay, but, here uh, we go. Move over. The PJs are moving. Oh, okay, we're good. All yeah, right, so uh, Vortex, you need this. How how how's it feel to go to round sixteen? Um, good, pretty good. Cool. Two two uh, two times I played against uh, Luis and two times close. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, I kept my Warriors last because I know it was a little bit favorite. So happy to queue up against that enter. Gotcha. Do you, you think uh, people will let you play that warrior again? Uh, sorry? Do you think people will let you play that warrior again in the future? Um, well, if they bring warrior themselves, like I'm favorite in the mirror matches yeah. because I'm so greedy, so um, they will have to take that in advance. But you, like, uh, I, I also feel that my paladin is really strong against uh, control warrior as well, so it's hard. What are you going to pick? Because I'm not going to ban your warrior. Do you think had she banned your warrior, it would have been a lot harder? I should have been there. No, if, if no, she if had banned she banned your priest. Uh, yes, yes. You, your indeed, you were scared of that? Um, I think it would be a... Well, the, the priest is also pretty strong against her lineup because she does have the, the hunter. Uh, it gets useless. And uh, I do have the Choma as well in my uh, priest, so I'm favored against Patron as well. So it also stops two of her decks. Mm -hmm. And it's not terrible against Druid either if you just ramp up uh, with Dragon Priest. So, like, the priest, it's a good ban. All right. Okay. Fair so there's enough. like no winning, con no winning situation. Like everything is bad if you ban. Sure. Sure. Yeah. All right. Well, well uh, I mean, I don't really have too many other questions um, about stuff because I mean, we we've, we've talked to you already before. Uh, what's up? <laughs> How you feeling? Are, are you enjoying Cesar Rico? Um, yeah, I feel good. I get one day of off as well tomorrow. I don't have to play, so I can prepare. I can watch all the matches. Can play, um, can play some poker downstairs. Yeah, play some poker. You can put your feet on Frodan's lap. Help my teammates as well. So feeling good. Uh, I wonder how Cyber did. I'm not sure yet. If you were to put your feet on one of our three laps, who would you choose? Frodan, come on, put it on. Put it up. Frodan, do it. Why, why me? Do it. I have the smallest lap. Oh. Do it or no balls. No balls. Oh man. Okay. <laughs>
All right, all right. No worries, man. We can do it off camera. All right, well, congratulations, Vortex. You go to round 16. Uh, I believe that an interview was awkward enough. It hit the quota. So with that, we're going to go to a break. We're done with Group B, which means we're going to go to Group C. Let's go ahead and look at the uh, my screen real quick to show Who's you what's going oh, on. Let's see, let's see. So in Group A, we had Purple Advance. Uh, Firebat and Cypher are playing for second place to advance. Uh, as Purple did beat Firebat in the winners. Uh, you, you just saw Vortex advance over Eloise um, in a very close two series back to back. And then in uh, Group C, we're going to have Zlay, Sixo, Gara, and Alesh. Group D will have Orange, Sansufa, Toy Dancer. Now, which group do you kind of want to watch on the mainstream? Uh, group D, to, I mean, it's kind of hard to say because I want to see Zlay and Sixo and Gara and Alesh. Nah, those guys are scrubs. But it's like, it's kind of tough because those two D. decks are pretty stacked. I think these two guys Wait. are really interesting, Sansifka and Toyota, because oh, they yeah. bring cool decks. Wait, let's ask the stream which, which group. Do and then watch. Surrender. Um, Surrender is like cool the Korean meta is also interesting right. to see. Korea was like, the, where the deck that Sixo got the Secret Paladin from that played in ATLC it was already and failed there. miserably. Yeah. So. Um, I, I know Surrender has a lot of rogues, so there's a chance he has that. I don't know. That, that would be cool. Yeah. Would be cool. Look at that thing on Frodan's arm. Dude, it's a, it's a D.Va tattoo, because uh, I'm such a D.Va. Mm. Okay. D.Va Unite. All right, guys, uh, we're going to take a break. When we come back, we're going to have Group D come up on the mainstream here at Seesaw Cup 4. So hashtag SSC4. We'll be right back. All right. All right. Good job, Breckful. You didn't say.